Hi everybody. Just want to do a, a quick live on um, how to say no and to mean it. Now I did a lovely session yesterday with one of my clients and she was such a great example of how to do this. I wanted to share it um, with you a little bit more. Hi Christy and Roxanne. Um, so how to say no and to mean it. It all comes down to your boundaries. So where are you actually able to be really conscious about your boundaries and to stand by them? Now to do this, you really need to be able to know what's important for you. What are your values? And I, I harp on about this, but if you don't know your core values, the rules to live them by and the boundaries to maintain them and also the consequences of those boundaries, then it's impossible to stand firm in what's right for you. Now, this particular lady, um, she was she had a long-term friend who was not treating her the best way and she was quite um, domineering. And um, so my client actually just had enough and she just said, no, don't, don't treat me like this anymore. Just stop talking to me like that. Um, just no. And she did it with such an energy and a conviction that her friend just didn't know what to do and you know, she reacted by leaving at that point. But my client was actually able to hold firm in her boundaries. She didn't go running after her and try and fix it. She actually just maintained her boundaries and didn't make how her friend felt her job to fix. So if you want to say no and mean it, you have to say no from within you, within your heart and how you want to be for yourself. Everything that we need, we must fill our needs buckets for ourselves first before we can fill other people's needs. So if we can say no to external things, we're actually saying yes to ourselves. So if you really want to have self-love, you have to say yes to yourself, which means you have to say no to others. So working through those processes of how to actually get that clarity is, as I said, values, rules to live and by, boundaries, and the consequences of those. It's really, really simple. It would take us probably about an hour if you wanted to actually get clear on those things. So please um, just put in a comment below values if you want to know more about that and we can have a chat. Um, so if you have this issue and you have, can't say no and you can't actually mean it, then please let me know because we can actually do something with that. So I hope you have a wonderful day. It's absolutely gorgeous day up here in Queensland. Um, we had a little bit of rain last night, which is so amazing um, where I am anyway, not at all of Queensland. So I hope you have a wonderful day and I look forward to chatting with you again soon. Thanks for now.